Hi, besties. So today we are going to be talking about making money with your unfair advantage. Yes, what is your unfair advantage? It's something that is unique to you, something that you have that is either an advantage to you or maybe a, an unfair advantage to you or an unfair advantage to others. I will explain better. So everyone is created differently. There is something that you have that is an unfair advantage. Yes, because um, others might be wondering why am I not the person that is like this? Or it might be something that is unfair to you. Either it is unfair to you or it's unfair to others. So, what am I trying to say? Now, it might be that you have a good figure. You have the the body that the bar glass shape that so many other people are going there to go and do bbl for and all that you have the big breast or the big bum bum it is an unfair advantage god created you this way but that is not even what i'm going to talk about now so how do you make money with this unfair advantage it might be that you are um there are some people that are what would i call it they are manipulative yes they are manipulative and when you when you say somebody is manipulative you tend to look at it at a negative way but there, there are ways that you can make money with it and there are ways that you can use it positively do you know the um, network marketing thing like bring two people to bring another two people they are people who have done that business and succeeded in it and some other people they keep when they bring them they keep looking for how to bring another two people that bring another two people and they've not been able to do that those people that have been growing to team leader to all the whole levels and going for the trips getting the money what do you think they are what do you think is different from them and you one is the contact they have two is what their ability to be what manipulative there are some people that if they tell you something now as in you will go and borrow money and do that thing if they explain something to you that same thing if another person explains it to you even using their exact words you will not be convinced there are people that have this convincing and manipulative spirit is inside them and some of them when they find themselves in network marketing or all these um businesses that need you to convince something or convince someone about something you see them do so well in that business because of their what unfair advantage they have found a way to use their unfair advantage to make money now you see people that um maybe have some skin condition maybe they are born differently they have some genital problem or all that and they have come out online with these and you see them having favor you see some people that are disabled doing some type of business and you see people patronizing them like when you see someone that is um amputated drawing even if you don't have um, a need for the person's drawing because that person is an amputee and you are wondering how can an amputee draw so well what will you do you will buy the person is using their unfair advantage to make money now there are some people that um have listened to some songs that you see blind people performing they'll come and be singing it's not as if their voice is so wonderful or they are singing what other people are not singing but you see them um you see people share their video you see people watch their video you see the likes you see the comments you see everything that happens now my country now is like um what is raining now is content creation and even around the world there is a news in content creation but the problem is that so many content creators have not even found out what is their unfair advantage they are you see everybody doing lifestyle content uh, uh, a day in my life come and go here with me make hair with me do, do nails with you do everybody is just doing the same content you have not sat down to ask yourself what is my unfair advantage what is the story that i will tell that the world will listen to every when everybody keep doing the same thing you even find people that have a boring life as my own boring life and they are coming to do lifestyle content what are we going to be seeing in your life people that have dared to venture you see some lifestyle content creators they will pierce their nose pierce their this one today they are doing that too tomorrow they are doing this one these are people that will get the views and the followership because they have the the world they are ready to explore people are ready to see them and look at what they are doing and just say ah how i wish i can do this but when you know that you don't even have so much to show 
for your life and you come and say you are doing lifestyle, lifestyle content you have not sat down to look at what is your unfair advantage it might be unfair to you it might be unfair to the world now let me tell you there are some people that have some unfair advantages that is unfair to them but with that being unfair to them they can motivate and make something good out of it some people were raped at their younger age they've experienced rape they've they've like seen it they experienced it they can talk about it but they will not talk about it you are still afraid to talk about it you are afraid that the world will judge you you are afraid of what people will say but if you come out and talk about it so many rape victims will find solax in you you will be able to be a voice to so many and you will use that unfair advantage to go places you will see people call you internations when there is um World Day right or the health sector is saying something about mental health, about people that are raped in their early age. You have passed through this process. You understand it. You can actually talk about these things even when you have been woken up from your sleep. You can even tell us what are the signs of um, what to look out for and um, how you felt when it happened to you. Some people are born survivors. They were born maybe um, by accident or what, whichever way they were born and they have come out to share their story and you see the world listening to them. There's one lady that is doing um, she's a model and she's modeling for burnt uh, skin she has a burnt skin and she has found a way to use her burnt skin to her own unfair advantage and now brands like to work with her um to model their clothes model their skincare products model their hair wigs and all that and if she has kept that her unfair advantage at the backyard without anybody seeing it nobody she wouldn't be able to get to where she is now because there are people that have exactly the same figure she has she's not that tall she's not she doesn't have such a beautiful skin and all that but the only unfair advantage she has is that she's born she's a born survivor and because of that she has been making wave in the fashion industry there are people that that are extremely dark very dark skin like this if you see them they are blacker than black and you have seen them come out to go into modeling or go into skincare or go into hair or whatever it is they are people that they are hair they don't need to do anything to grow it i have i have someone that i follow um her hair, her hair by natural something if you see this girl's hair very very long i know that it's not those products that she uses on that hair that is making that hair grow like that it's her unfair advantage she has gene for long hair and she has found a way to use it she started a hair care product line and it's selling out fast people are coming to buy buy this hair care products to work on their own hair and it, it will work for some people it will definitely not work for some people you might have a clear skin how many will i say and leave the other what i want to tell you today is that if you are looking for a way to make money first thing first go and sit down and find out what is your own unfair advantage like me now i am very very intelligent and i can analyze things the way you cannot analyze it the way i see things is not the way you will see things if you have a document in your hand you will read it and you will drop it i'll read that same document and i will explain it to you the way that you did not understand it you that read it the first way so as you are finding your own me personally i'm also looking for my own ways to make money with my unfair advantage either to become a um what will i call it document analyst or read things i don't know how to put it but somehow i found out that i can analyze things better than the average human being yes and my mind works different works um i don't know how to say it but sometimes i know the end to a beginning of a thing if someone if um someone comes to me now and say ah do you know that this person this person? i'll tell you don't worry this thing it will just do this and this. and at some at most times 90 percent of the time that thing always happens like that the person actually does this or does that or it happens even in relationship if you come and tell me that this person and this person is getting together if i look at the guy and look at sometimes i don't even want to say it i'll just leave it to happen but it has it will come to my mind that ah, this person is not the right person for this person or these people are not getting this thing right or this thing will happen this way or this thing will not happen this way you know back home in my country they will say it's prophecy <laughs> i don't know whether it is but i know that i've found some things that are easier for me to do than it is easier for an average man to do and i am in a journey to find on how to make money 
with my unfair advantage and i am daring you to do what to sit down today and think about what is your unfair advantage and how to make money with your unfair advantage before you start looking for external source of means to make money you are going to go and learn a skill you are going to go and learn how to become this or how to become that but you have not even utilized and enhanced the one that god has given you that can make money for you so if you sit down and see that you can do this you can do that with eff effortlessly like you can do it without putting much effort what do you need to do you find out what is the possible ways that you can make money doing this then you do what you enhance this skill you hone this skill you look for people that have same skills with you and the way they have been able to manage themselves manage their skills and become a better version of themselves and you use it positively to your own benefit and you will find a way to make money from it i hope this helps someone today and i want to read what is your unfair advantage on the comment section see you next time bye